So in honor of Women's History Month and Liebert's 50th anniversary as an institution, Women's Studies and my digital art course decided to collaborate on a project where the Women's Studies students interviewed and did oral histories of a number of women that were involved with Leeward Community College to get an idea of what their experience was here and how it influenced them in their lives. And then they passed it on to my digital art students and we created visuals from those stories and those narratives. As a women's studies professor, um, my culminating project is an interview project. So I have usually have my students interview women who have a wide variety of experiences. From my students' perspective, um, they were working on taking what was written um, and actually trying to focus in on a qualitative idea. And how do you visually communicate that in a way that gets at the core of the issue without people having to know all the little details of the story? The goals for the assignment for women's studies um, is to hear the stories of women um, and then to put that tapestry together and to see what we can learn about society as a whole. We thought that it would be a nice opportunity for our students um, where they were involved with people other than just themselves in the class and they could have some kind of impact on the greater community here at the school. From the person that I interviewed, which was Della Teraoka, um, well, going into this interview, I was expecting to hear a lot of negative things, but um, well, she had actually a lot of positive experiences, and it just kind of inspired me to do the best that I can and not to let anything hold me back. As long as you have the mindset of going for what you want and not letting anything stop you, like Della. My interview was on Vice Chancellor Della Terry Oka, and she's been here for quite some time. So it was a little bit of a challenge for me to try and figure out how to portray her career and her journey um, onto one visual. When we presented, we both had the same idea of who Della was. So I think we did a good job at communicating. As far as the collaboration part, it was really neat working with another student from a different class. I mean, there's challenges for that, obviously. Um, but I thought it taught me a lot too. I'd never done a collaboration before. So I liked that I was able to learn some other things for takeaway for a future um, and just have someone else's perspective as well. The woman I chose to interview was Renata Norris, which is my aunt. The first process that I took to do the interview was uh, first like coming up with the questions, thinking of the right questions to ask her. You know, telling a story is, is quite complex. But once I got it down, it was really easy to ask, especially because she is my auntie. It was pretty, you know, informal in the interview process. And I did learn things about her that I didn't know before. And so that also made it a little more special for me to tell her story. My subject, her name was Renata Norris, and she had a condition called lupus. Um, some of the difficulties she experienced for uh, her health and in, in class because she had a hard time with keeping her mind clear and had severe pain during class. So all of those challenges caused lots of turbulence for her and, and kind of derailed her plans. So instead of taking a, a straight path to get to her goal and to accomplish her goal of uh, graduating, she had all these unexpected turns. I guess Leeward is an important part of her path, but it was really all these words in here, all of her determination, her strength, her courage, that made that path possible and kind of propelled her along this journey. In the beginning, kind of difficult to try and um, really relay everything that you know you got in an interview, but she still managed to produce such an amazing poster for it. It was an amazing accomplishment that I could, you know, take someone's story and then make something that I think does a great job of telling her story and looking at it like I used all these tools and stuff that I, I had no idea what I would how to do it a few months ago. So this was a, a huge like vote of confidence for me and um, I don't know, it was, a, it was a great experience for me. I feel like involving community, getting in touch with other people really adds meaning to learning. Um, also just making things a little more, not just applying to real world and, and practicing for real world activities, but actually making it a real world activity. What I've heard from the students was that this was a really powerful way for the students to connect um, and they all developed this uh, 
affinity for the woman that they interviewed, which I think was just a real added bonus. Everybody felt this real powerful connection to hearing women's stories and especially women who have come through Leeward Community College, which was part of the goal, but I think really we met it and it was a very um, deep and powerful experience for our students.